It's now 6.53, time for six things you need to know before you go. And we do begin in Barnwell with a murder investigation underway. Police say around 7 yesterday evening, the body of 31-year-old George Grimes was found inside of a car on Fairway Lane. No suspect information has been released. And the Aiken County Republican Party will host a forum today for the Republican County Council Chairman candidates. It'll be held at 6 tonight at the Stevenson McClellan Pro, uh, Building at St. Thaddeus in downtown Aiken. Uh, during the forum, all three candidates will ask or answer questions and talk about their plans for the future. Tonight, Grovetown City leaders want your input on the proposed millage rate hike. They're looking at raising it from 6.9 mills to 9 mills later this year. The city is $550,000 short, and leaders say the new rate would balance the budget. The last hearing is tonight at 6 in the city council chambers. President Donald Trump's son-in-law, Jared Kushner, is scheduled to appear on Capitol Hill today. He is set to answer questions from senators as part of an investigation into Russian meddling in the 2016 election. The hearing is expected to be behind closed doors. Then tomorrow, Kushner will face another round of questions from a House panel. Good Monday morning, everyone. As we're starting out a new work week, a look at the roadways and our traffic this morning with this traffic update. Finding no accidents or delays so far this morning as we're getting into work. Do have a traffic note for you folks in Columbia County, Riverwatch Parkway Extension. We got a traffic shift that's going to start today through Thursday from Jamaica Court to Wintry Place. Also, you're going to find a new turn on the Columbia Industrial Boulevard. Be aware of those changes. Drive safely and buckle up as you're getting into work this morning. In the WGAC 24-hour news traffic and weather center, for News Channel 6, I'm Zach Taylor. And your forecast by 9 this morning, mostly cloudy skies, 78 with a small chance for a few showers by noon. We'll be at 90 degrees. Better chance for rain and storms by 5 with temps at 94 degrees and still at 90 by 8 with a 40% chance for scattered showers and storms.